What's up? My name is Technova here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I'll be talking about how to install and use the latest release of Optifine for Minecraft 1.19. In the description down below, you'll find a link to Optifine.net, their official website. Currently, you'll need to look for Minecraft 1.19 and expand preview versions in order to find the download and mirror download button here. You can click download to view an ad and support the Optifine developers, or you can click mirror to skip the ad and head straight to the download. Then click download once more, and we're now successfully downloading the preview version of Minecraft Optifine 1.19. Do note that this is currently a preview. When you're watching this video, it may not be a preview anymore. If you're watching this in the future, you'll need to click show all versions here to see the previous versions of Minecraft Optifine in order to download and use them. Once the Optifine jar has finished downloading, simply click on it to open it up. And assuming you have Java installed, you'll see a window like this. If instead it opens up WinRAR or something similar, in the description down below, you'll find a link to something called Jar Fix. All you need to do is simply run that. And when it's done, try open the jar file once more by simply double clicking on it. And you should see this install window here. Simply click install, making sure that this is correct. By default, Minecraft is in roaming.minecraft, so clicking install will get it to install properly. If you've moved it somewhere else, then you'd know and you'd be able to change it here. I'll click OK and close out of the installer. Now, in order to actually play Minecraft with Optifine, I'll simply open up the normal vanilla Minecraft launcher. Head into Minecraft Java Edition, and from the drop down of versions here, you'll see Minecraft Optifine 1.19. Simply click on it, and we can click play to start playing. If you don't see it, you can head across to installations at the very top and click a new installation. Then from the version list over here, you should see release 119 Optifine here. Simply click it and add it to your list. In order to edit it, head across to the installations tab, find it, click the three dots, then edit. And after expanding more options, we're able to change the amount of RAM that Optifine starts with. I have a huge amount of RAM in my computer, so I can set this to say six gigs, four gigs, anything like that. The capital G standing for gigabytes. So XMX 6G means I can play Optifine with six gigs of RAM and it should run pretty well. Though that's out of the scope of this video. Now that you have Optifine here, you can either head across to installations, hover over it and click play, or you can select it from the versions drop down on the play tab and hit play here. If you see this pop up, tick the box and click play. There we go. Once Minecraft is started up, you'll see modded in the bottom left and heading into options, then video settings, you'll see a bunch of new tabs here, as well as Optifine's watermark in the bottom left hand side. We can customize our performance options and everything else as you usually would. And congratulations, we've now successfully installed Optifine so we could use shaders in vanilla Minecraft, etc, etc. It's incredibly simple, but people do often ask me how to install Minecraft Optifine. So, well, here's a very simple tutorial on how to do it for Minecraft 1.19. Anyways, that's really about it for this quick video. Thank you all for watching. My name is Techno over here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.